Hey guys, it's B-Man again, and we're back for part three of this space adventure that I have to hit the continue button to get to. Um, I'm slightly ill, but being slightly ill does not stop me from my space duties or hitting the continue button, because I'm not a cripple. I still have both arms, so this is a possibility. So we're still in sector six is where we left off, um, right here. And since I'm here, by the way, he died in space. It's tragic, but you must remember him in memory and go on to the next level, which is this beautiful civilian sector. Civilian sectors, um, usually civilian sectors are like, oh, this is a rock control sector. What did I think I was in a civilian sector? I was just in a civilian sector, I'm sorry. See, I'm sick, too sick to think. Uh, I'm in a rock controlled second, there. Rot the rocks! Um, some, there's some lethal battles you'll get into with the, the rocks, and they're not that hard. They just have rock plating, which, as you might remember, um, prevents a lot of hull damage. It only lets you do system damage. And, well, while system damage can be kind of useful, it's not really that useful unless you're, like, hitting out their weapons and just waiting it out. So, here we are. Um, they don't have any, they have a small bomb, and I don't think that'll do anything, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna get, uh, what am I gonna do? I don't know what I'm doing. We're just gonna wait it out. Um, I think I'll target their shields, honestly, because this, they have a laser drone on us, but laser drones cannot penetrate shields. However, they just small bombed us, and that sort of sucks. Yeah, um... Laser drones cannot penetrate shields. They can only penetrate your hull if they just manage to hit your hull. There's another small bomb somewhere. It's in our door system, which kind of sucks. However, they don't really have any weapons left. Nor do they have any shields left, because we sort of destroyed them. So we're going to contact the Federation. And now we have a quest! Hooray! So I'm going to get my... No, Squidward should be here. I need to get my other guy to do all the fixing, because... Well, oh, I have a rock guy. I somehow missed him existing, so I'm gonna put him in the med bay. He'll be like our fighter, our resident fighter, and then my other NG will be well, over here. Um, how we're gonna go about this? Um, we're definitely gonna have to like set this system up, but this is good. Um, no. I have a quest marker. I just took another quest. I could go into this asteroid field, and I'm probably going to, because A, once you have more than one shield, asteroid fields are pretty useless unless the people you're fighting are really well set up. <laughs> Help me. But, um, to cope with this, I'm going to put down my burst laser too and put up my defense, because they got missiles. And also, defense to take down asteroids. So, if I'm lucky enough... So my invasion's pretty good, but if anything, my, my defense can at least take out one missile. So I'm gonna take down their shields, as that seems to be the most important thing that I'm not taking down yet. Um, luckily, I've done God's work, and my artillery beam has destroyed them. My defense drone is not doing a very good job of stopping them from hitting me with missiles, but that's okay. Now they can only hit me with something. But it doesn't matter because the artillery beam is about to do this. I could surrender. However, I don't surrender. Ever. And I got more scrap. You want to know why? Because these assholes just wanted to surrender because they just wanted to. So now we can just sit around here and repair and wait. It doesn't really matter. Um, uh, here, if you highlight the people on your ship, you can see what they're like skills are. Wife has got double shields. Almost. That looks like looks like Squid Wife's about to level up. Um, 54 out of 45. That's pretty good. Um, Dirk Funk is... Well, this is gonna be good. Um, I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna get my other NG back here. Uh, Alright, so we're gonna get out of the rock controlled sector pretty quick. Just kidding. We're gonna, we're gonna dawdle a lot. This is a pretty risky move as the Federation is really moving pretty quick up at me. Fuck the slavers. We're not taking the slave this time, though. 
They have missiles. So now I have to make an executive decision on whether I want to uh, employ defense or not. And I could. And it would probably be a good idea. But instead, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do an artillery nerf. Now the artillery beam will probably still hit if this, these guys still last long enough. The only problem I have to deal with is the fact that they have cloaking. And if I don't take out their cloaking systems, um, bad things might happen. But I'm going to not target. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do a waiting game. My big laser is going to take out the shields first, and then I'm going to take out the cloaking with my burst laser too. Hopefully, before they uh, do anything. Alright, so their cloaking's down, which means, evidently, that uh, they won't be cloaking or going anywhere soon. I, that was really too risky for anything good to be done, but I'm going to hit them with my burst laser 3. They tried to cloak, because they managed to get their cloaking back online, and that's probably not a good thing. Ah, they're cloaking. Well, I hit them with an artillery beam, and that's sort of good. However, this is really not a good situation for me to be in. There's not only... The, uh, I'm not going to take another guy. I already have too many guys on my ship, so I'm gonna like destroy this slaver ship and take their 71 scrap. You can't tell me that wasn't worth it. I'm gonna go here, then I'm gonna jump to the store. Federation will probably be right on my tail once I get to the store. Uh, so, we <laughs> tried to put the rock on the comp, it didn't work. Um, they have missiles. It's this the defense one is gonna be useful. Oh, yeah. This isn't good. Um,. This is hardly the time for Francois to get f messed up. They're gonna take out m that. That's a problem, so I'm gonna get both my rock guys on it. They're slow, but there's nothing I can do, really. I could just hope that my defense drone takes out their shit, so they can't take out ours, and I'm gonna hope that my lasers can charge fast enough. My Rockmen have lots of health, and it's a two-on-two -two battle, so we're pretty well set up. Alright, so now all their stuff's down. And now I'm gonna take down this guy, put my artillery back up, and hope it wrecks shit. One of my Rock guys is dying. That's sort of a problem. The med bay's not up, because it's not. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put one shield down one up. So they destroyed that. That's not good. And I can't really funnel them anywhere, because they sort of spawn in a bad place. Um, best, best case scenario really is to just blow up this ship right now. Which is what I'm going to do, hopefully. So they went, see? Because they knew that their ship was about to get destroyed. And rightfully so. Assholes. I'm going to get my repairing NG to repair all this stuff. So that swamps can go back to here. And then I'm gonna get, yeah, I'm gonna get my NG to prepare that. Sasha's gonna go over here again. Close the doors. Oh, we got lots of scrap again. And I'm gonna get Francois back in the driver's seat now. So there we go. And now we can disable that and re enable that. We're in pretty good hands. We have two stars all around. My shield guy leveled up recently. And now we have almost weapons up. But this is gonna be a hard sell. Like I said, they're gonna be right behind us every step of the way. But I'm gonna see there's something in the store, because it could be. There wasn't anything in the store. It's really not that surprising. But, we could still, like, go places if we have to. But we're gonna go to the distress signal, and I wanna get to the quest marker to see what they have over there. Uh, we're gonna look for this ship. There's another. We already have a stasis chamber. I'm not gonna grab a second one. <laughs> okay, I don't know how that happened. I don't think that's ever happened to me. I'm gonna do the quest now. I don't know what the quest entails, but it should be fun. Oh, more scrap. So now I'm rich. I could go here, here, and here if I really wanted to, and I'm probably going to. But I'm rich. So I could, you know what? Mercenaries suck. So they have cloaking too. But they don't have, well, they don't have missiles, so I'm not going to put my defense. However, they do have ions, which could be a problem, but it won't be right now. So now we're going to wait it out. I want to hit their cloaking device. 
It's going to be a hard sell to hit it. Unless Spire Artillery Beam does it for me. Ah, they've got good evasion. However, see how my Artillery Beam still hit them even in Cloak? That's because it can. So now they're a little destroyed. Their weapon systems are down a bit, and I mean, they could get me with their beam, but we're too fast. I need this to hit. I'm not very getting very good luck at hitting anything. Okay, so I managed to take out their cloaking system, which I guess did some things. My artillery beam's gonna do a lot more. Now, what we need to focus on is their weapon systems, as they could probably do some serious damage unless we're careful. So now their weapon systems are down, and I'm not accepting surrender because these guys are assholes. And I don't surrender. My artillery beam's gonna do the rest of the work, so I'm just gonna sit and wait for it to happen. Alright, so it happened. I didn't take any damage, so I didn't really lose anything fighting that shit. Now we're gonna go to the store. And there's nothing good in the store, which won't be surprising. <sighs> what did I tell you? We're gonna sell firebomb because it's really not useful to me. And we're gonna buy all the fuel that I have. Before I jump, we're gonna go and upgrade some stuff. We have a hilarious amount of scrap. We've only got four more power bars to use. The reason for this is, well, there's a lot of stuff to upgrade. We're gonna need to step it up. I'm thinking evasion is important, and so is shields. We could get four shields and an, ev and an ev double evasion boost and might max that out there. I think that might be a good idea. And I could I could go for getting the small bomb, but I feel that there's, no, there's not really a big point. And what I could do is I could disable the burst laser too and then activate a defense drone and then activate small bomb, if that's what I really want to do. So, I mean, this could go anyway. And what I could do also is, you know, I could do a variety of things. So we're, I think I'm going to go for max shields um, in a double evasion. That that would cost about 280, which I have. Yeah, this looks good. So it would be like that, that, that. And then I could also go for better blast doors. And then um, seeing the enemy interior can be good and out of evasion. Um... Actually, we need double bars, don't we? <laughs> and we're out. This is a problem. I might wait on that. Yeah, I might wait on getting more evasion and just get the shields. Or maybe I'll get more evasion and wait on getting the shields. So I'll get that, that, and then I can get this, which I want, and this, which I also want, and then that. And then I can just buy the rest of the things right now. Okay, I'll do that. Evasion's up. Um, yeah, we could save two of these for a defense drone or something in the future. Alright, we, we can get out of here now. We're gonna be in warning, but we're gonna make it, so it doesn't really matter. Um, repair five damage. I didn't even think we had five damage to repair. <laughs> so we're gonna jump. We can only go one more place, because as you can see... There's only one place to go to, which is the Mantis Controlled Sector. We made the decision to not go there last time, but now we have to go there. So here we are. Mantises are well known for invasions of your ship, and fighting them right now would be a bad idea. I farmed that last sector pretty good, even if that was Sector 6. I think I'm just gonna go straight away. I could go to this asteroid field, and it probably is a bad idea that I do this, but I'm gonna do it anyway. So they don't have a teleporter, it's just an auto assault. Auto assaults are annoying, but they're not like lethal and they're not gonna like kill me, so. But what I wanna do is I wanna take out their shields. Those are the most important things to take out right now. It's gonna be a hard sell, but we're gonna need to do it. We missed literally everything. That's why my artillery beam was going to do the rest of the work for us. That was not what I wanted. <laughs> I mean, my, my defense drone shit. Oh, I missed anyway. So it doesn't matter. Oh my god. There we go. Now their shields are down to two, which is pretty good. I think my artillery beam might take the rest of this down. Oh, almost. Almost. So I just need one more hit. And lo and behold, they got that last hit. We're gonna get out of here as fast as possible. I might hit up some ships for upgrades, because at past this point, you won't get any more scrap, and I think I need those shields. 
Now see, this is one of those mantis ships that are not good. They're gonna send in guys to invade me. What I'm gonna do is, depending on where they are, I'm gonna funnel them into the bay. And I'm gonna send Rocky Horror Picture Show over here, and I guess... Uh, well, we'll see. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna target... They have no... They have a burst laser. They have a laser, and then I have a small bomb. I might target their shields anyway, but it could also be definitely good to target that. So we'll, we'll see what we can do. So here they are. I'm gonna get them in the med bay. They're gonna try to flood in here. I'm gonna get my. I'm gonna get Squid Boy in there too. Eventually, it's gonna get really. It's gonna get to the point where they're dying and really need to get into the med bay. Because look. Also, so they tried to small bomb a thing that wasn't a system this, and I think it's kind of silly. But look, they're going to try to get into the med bay because they're stuck there dying. I mean, I can't upgrade my stuff from here, but it's a necessary evil that I do this. It's gonna hit a lot, and then what's gonna happen is I'm gonna hit their shields, because they need to be hit. So now we're gonna finish them off. They're already dying. So now we need we need to get our oxygen back. So we're gonna get it back. Um squid weapons to go here. They might get kinda hurt. Um, I need Dirk Funk back there. Rocky right here need to stay here. They're trying to small bomb things that aren't systems, which is kind of funny because small bomb only does system damage. So now we can hit them with our lasers. I didn't notice. And now my gun also leveled up. So now I have two stars on everything, which means I'm totally ready to kick ass. Um, no one's really hurt too bad, so I might just leave them where they are right now. Uh, but I could always re-enable this. Get, get some healing done. Just to make, just for like, confidence sake. Okay. So. We have a distress signal, which we can go to. Or we can go here. Or we can go here. I might do a little like, scoop across the sky. Distress, this obviously means this is probably a fake distress signal, but not also, oh, it's not. Because ships aren't always bad at distress signals. So I'm going to give them fuel. And they gave me scanner upgrades, which means I know where the store is now, and I know where I'm going to go from here. So this could be potentially pretty good. What's here? Oh, another auto drone. And even worse, this is an auto drone that has a fucking, like, charge on us. What they're gonna do is they're gonna try to get away from us using their FTL and then tell the fleet we're here, and then the fleet will speed up. How do you stop that terrible thing from happening? Well, you... you kill them. You kill their engines, that is. Which hopefully I'll hit. I hit, sort of. With my engines? Oh, but then again, now it's on fire. So what now? Well, I just wait now. They're hitting a lot of things with their ion beam, making my ship a lot weaker. But luckily, they won't be lasting much longer either, because my artillery beam will probably take care of this. In fact, I don't really have a doubt that my artillery beam is going to take care of it, like, now. So, we didn't really lose anything, we took a couple bits of damage, and now we're here. So let's jump here. We're almost there to getting max shields. Um... We could get scrap like this, but I couldn't... I, now I don't have max shields, but I can fight this guy and get them. Yeah, okay. Because I need those shields. Those are important, and... Once again, there's really nothing. There's really nothing to get here. Okay. So we're going to jump to uh, here and fight whatever's there before leaving. Oh no, it's another Mantis ship, and oh no, they've got a teleporter! But that's okay. There's a reason to upgrade at the blast doors. So, they've got lots of lasers, and I've got lots of reasons to not let them use their lasers on me. They're gonna teleport here again. And once again... I'm gonna flood the compartment. Wait. 
with air. I'm gonna flood it all with air. I have to. So I'm gonna get Derek out of here. So they're gonna be trying to destroy stuff and then they're gonna be dying. And then they're gonna be like, oh shit, we're gonna die. And plus, we have better blasters than they do. Making this really useful. Alright, we hit. Ooh, their weapon systems got really, really destroyed. Alright, so they're trying to get away. Uh, we hit their engines a bit, which is exactly what I wanted to do. Oh my god, they might die of asphyxiation. Okay, they almost died of asphyxiation. Not quite, though. So I'm gonna close all these doors. I'm gonna wait it out so that nobody dies of asphyxiation. Um, I need to get... Swamps is always good. Alright, so I need to get Dirk Funk out of there. Because he needs to charge the weapons now. We need to hit their engines. Which is what we're going to do. Because if they get away... Oh, they got away! We're gonna go after them. Why? Because this is a vendetta, pal. So yeah, they're gonna teleport onto our base again. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to trap them in there and kill them. What I'm just going to do is I'm gonna let them die. How does this work? Well, it just will. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to, um... I should have defense up. They only have single lasers, so they could get down my shields and then hit me with a thing. So I, so I might just down this. But then again, I have this, so I don't know why I was trying to do that. We're gonna wait it out. Calmly. These mantises are going to die, I guarantee it. They're being funneled into death. So we need to hit their shields. Those, those are the most important things that exist right now on their ship. That we're uh, in, in jeopardy of. We're also gonna set them on fire. Um, they're gonna try to get away again, in which I say, fuck that, but... I mean, I don't know how, how this is gonna work. We need to hit their, their engines again. Right now, they're pretty vulnerable, but this is not gonna stop them if we don't. I'm trying to get this down to the wire. Okay, so we're gonna hit this. Now. We're gonna hit their engines. They're gonna try to give us... 80 scraps, pretty good. Hull smash your lasers, also pretty good. I might let them live. So I got the whole laser, which can do a lot of damage, actually. In fact, it can do a lot more damage than this can. So we're going to be switching between these. Now we're going to get the hell out of here, because we're sort of in a jam. I'm also running out of fuel, but guess what? We're almost to the final sector, and now we're about to be the final sector. Okay, we're not gonna explore the asteroid field, because I'm gonna get this, and we're gonna be done with upgrades. Done! Four shields. Now, what do you, now you might ask, what about the drones? Well, we'll find a way to use them. The last stand is the last sector. 